virtual reality is uh, set in a spaceship 30 years in the future. Um, 12 astronauts have been chosen for this mission, which is basically uh, a discovery mission to see if there's another planet Earth. Um, we've received a signal from this star and we think that there may be intelligent life there. Um, something which, uh, you know, Marco, since Marconi invented the radio now has, has been something that we've been waiting for and it's kind of one of those science fiction myths, you know, a distant signal from a distant star and what does it mean, does it mean there's intelligent life? So virtuality is a search for intelligent life but it's also um, a reality show on board a ship so apart from being astronauts, we've been brought here to provide entertainment for people back home um, and to provide some kind of escape for us all. We ha all have our own um, virtual modules with our own private worlds. I play a character called Rika Goddard. She's married to Roger Fallon, who's the ship's psychologist. Um, she's a microbial, but she's a botanist and a microbial exobiologist. And I think I know what those things mean. Ron Moore's a massive sort of superstar in the world of sci-fi and in this genre. Um, I think what's interesting is that there are no uh, parameters. So because the virtual world can be anything from kind of, you know, the Civil War to a beach house to, you know, being a rock star on stage, um, any story can be told. Anything that's a wonderful story can be put into somebody's life and can be explored and can be made relevant. And it's all about the psychological impact of these virtual worlds on our real selves.